Good afternoon students. Hope you all are doing well. Well, in my previous session, I have dealt with prepositions and I'll just revise all the words that come in the category of prepositions. The words are like, about, till, out, above, against, below, beneath, beside, besides, between, through, up, upon, within, during, except, for, from, in, of, on, onto, opposite, near, of, beside, behind, inside, outside, into, around, before, among, to, along, at, toward, under, underneath, across, until, with, beyond, by, down, since, without, after, etc. So these are the commonly used prepositions. So now I will give you some exercises and you need to solve them carefully. The first exercise, use the appropriate prepositions from the brackets to fill in the blank spaces. Number one, they are very proud dash their success. In the bracket, we have two words of slash about. Number two, he boasted dash his accomplishments. He boasted dash his accomplishments. In the bracket, we have two words of about. Number three, my sister is Afrid dash dogs. My sister is Afrid dash dogs. We have two words in the bracket of oblique from. Number four, someone is dash at the door. In the bracket, we have two words at slash on. Number five, she comes dash a noble family. She comes dash a noble family. In the bracket, we have two words of oblique from. Next, he is ill dash fever. In the bracket, we have two options from oblique with. Next, I differ dash you on this point. In the bracket, we have two words from with. Number Next number, I don't agree dash her on this point. In the bracket, we have two words, to, oblique, with. Next, we all agreed dash her proposal. In the bracket, we have two words, with, oblique, to. Next, he was born dash a small village dash the sea. In the bracket, we have two words, in, oblique, by. She sat dash her husband. In the bracket, we have two words beside, oblique, besides. Next, he is not dash home just now. In the bracket, we have two words in, oblique, at. Next, the train is dash time. In the bracket, we have two words in, oblique, on. Next, she parted her children in tears. She parted dash her children in tears. In bracket, we have two words with oblique form. He hates to part dash his money. He hates to part dash his money. In the bracket, we have two words from oblique with. Now, we have the next exercise that means it is a different type of exercise you have to find out the errors we have to sorry you have to find out the error this is error correction okay you have to strike out the word which is not required in the sentence and that 
may be a preposition. Number one. We reached at the airport at 9 p.m. We reached at the airport at 9 p.m. In other words, you have to edit the sentences. Strike out the word which is not required in the sentence. Number two. The teacher entered into the classroom. The teacher entered into the classroom. Number three. We discussed about the matter. We discussed about the matter. Number four. She is improving. She is improving leaps and bounds. She is improving leaps and bounds. In this sentence, you have to do one thing. That is, you have to insert the preposition that is missing. She is improving leaps and bounds. You have to insert the preposition in this sentence that's, that is missing. Second also, Ahan resigned his job. This also, you have to insert the preposition that is missing. Ahan re resigned his job. She is married a French man. Here also, you have to insert the preposition that is missing. She is married a French man. So, these are the exercises related to prepositions. Please solve them carefully. Now, I want to discuss one thing that's been noticed in the comment section. There was a comment that please de deal with basic grammar. I could not just understand what you mean by basic grammar because I have dealt with prepositions, I have dealt with articles and to me these are the basic grammar items to start with in class 7. If you can, whoever has put the comment, if you can kindly specify which grammar item you want me to deal with, I will do it accordingly. Thank you children.